Hi, I'm Chris. Um, I am showing you tonight the layout I made um, today using the Close to My Heart um, exclusive you and me kit um, that I received in my new consultant kit when I signed up for Close to My Heart to be an independent cons independent consultant. Um, I'm going to get the camera off me because I'm doing this at night and the lighting is really bad. Okay. So here's the layout I made today out of the You and Me kit that I actually did a you stream on yesterday. It's a two page layout. You can kind of see. This was my son's birthday party last year. I'll kind of do one page at a time. And the kit, um, like I said, it is from Close to My Heart. It's for um, National Scrapbooking Month, which is in May. Um, if you order $50 of Close to My Heart products, you get um, the kit for $15. Let me move my camera a second. Otherwise, the kit alone is $34.95. And if you become a consultant in May, you get the kit for free. Um, you get, I showed you yesterday, and I forgot... Was it yesterday or the day before? Yesterday. I forgot to show you that you get ribbon in the kit too. Besides the the large size large size stamp set, the you and me stamp set, you get I used um half of this already. The ribbon and the opaques. And the instruction guide, which shows you how to do two two-page layouts. And you get um, the Irresistibles, which I used already. Most of them, some of them. I still have enough for another two-page layout. Um, I'll show you how I use those. One piece of the Colonial White cardstock, which this is what I have left of a 12 by 12 piece, so I didn't use that much, so I have enough for that, for another layout, and um, six pieces of the background and texture paper, the thicker cardstock type paper, um, four of them, which I think yesterday on camera I didn't, I didn't show, this is like a ledger with journaling kind of text script on it. There's four pages of these and every all the papers are double sided. This one also has some script on it too. Let's see if I can. It's hard to see. Um, and then you get a polka dotted with a smoothie color in it, that pinkish coralish color. Yeah, that's smoothie. Um, and then you get more of a a brown one, which I used up. This is all I have left of the other piece of paper. <laughs> but I have some left. Oh, I hear Jack upstairs. Okay. <laughs> Jack is supposed to be sleeping. It is 10, 18 p.m. here. This word celebrate is from the Irresistibles um, chipboard, and I inked them with, let's see, that is the greenish, that is the olive. I inked them with olive, and I used um, the little finger daubers to ink that. And then I went around with another finger dauber, and you can't probably really see it. I just did some brown stays on around the end. And here's the ribbon I used. Um, this is the stamp, one of the stamps. I um, popped it up and journaled on here. The background is a piece of the colonial white. I just fussy cut it around. And I um, inked it again with the olive ink and a dauber. I just inked the paper. Um, 
just the patterned paper in the kit, an irresistible, um, two layers of um, Oh, I'm tired. Um, I did two layers. <laughs> I don't even know. Two layers. Um, this piece is um, the cardstock, the colonial white cardstock that I inked with the the olive ink and the dauber. These little, there's the opaques in the middle. I just used the stamp again, um, and I stamped with. I think that color was the desert sand and the stamp image I used was this little banner piece right here and because Jack was three in this at this birthday party I just laid it one two three and I kind of just did that there just to bring attention to Jack in this picture this is another irresistible that I inked with the olive and then I actually stamped over it with the desert sand it's kind of subtle but I used one of the other stamps. Um, just the paper inked around it. Nothing special here. This is one of the irresistibles that I inked and wrote on. Did a little journaling here. I'm trying to think if there's anything special on that page. I had a lot of fun doing this. A lot of fun. This page, I didn't follow the layouts on the in the instruction guide, but I did kind of steal this from them, the banner. Um, these are not stamped, but they're some of the irresistibles, and then the opaques again, those little um, pearl embellishments. And then you probably can't see it, but I did stamp using the stitch on the stamp. Let me go back to that. The stitching right here, I curved it on the block and I made it as my line string or whatever you want to call it to put the banner. And then I inked the banner, the um, irresistibles, a different olive, and then the desert sand. So this is a combination of stamp, opaques, the irresistibles, and then the inking. And then I went around with the brown stays on. That was fun. So that idea I took from the instruction guide, but everything else I just kind of did um, off of what I wanted to do with the pictures. Another irresistible, this piece here, one of the floor stamps. This is a happy day, that's one of the stamps that I stamped onto the irresistible. Um, the cardstock, um, journaling stamp, orderly stamp, celebrate stamp, journaling on the paper, oops, sorry, um, this other arrow is another, um, irresistible, Duke is the name of our cat, Dukey was sitting right there behind Jack while he was doing his cake, and what else, just some more little journaling here, so I've been, um, these pictures are almost a year old, and I've been because there's so many birthday pictures I just couldn't <laughs> it was hard for me to um, get started on scrapbooking his birthday so I took my favorite pictures and used this kit and did a two page layout today um, so I told you if you spend $50 on close to my heart products you get this kit for $15 and it's a I think it's a great I think it's a great deal I mean the, the large size stamp set alone is worth worth it. Plus you get the opaques, the ribbon, the paper, the instructions, and the irresistibles. The irresistibles are fun. I couldn't wait to use those. Those are fun. Um, otherwise, it's free if you sign up as a consultant. And then one more thing I wanted to say before I signed off today. Tomorrow, Monday the 23rd and Tuesday the 24th, I am participating in a, um, this is non close to my heart talk now, <laughs> um, a YouTube hop and it's for us, it's a scrapbook layout YouTube hop and, um, the hosts are Lemore and Zoe, I think I'm saying their names right, and the sponsor of the hop, 
because they're giving doing some giveaways is um, an online store scrap a lot I'll tell you more in my video tomorrow they're gonna give away two kits um, to viewers of the YouTube hop I'm not sure how that's gonna work um, but tomorrow there's six people um, doing it and it starts with Lee Moore and her YouTube address is um, it's spelled L-I-M-O-R 1278 and she is the start of it and she is one of the hosts and then the second host is Zoe and she's next on there and her YouTube name is AF0093 um, so Lee Moore is first and Zoe is second um, this is not the layout I am doing for the YouTube hop. I have another one that I'm going to do and I'll post that one um, tomorrow. There's six people posting their two-page layout or their layout. I don't think it has to be a two-page layout. Their scrapbooking layout. Oh, my camera just let go. Sorry. Um, six people tomorrow, which is Monday, and then six people on Tuesday. And I'm part of the Tuesday group. So I'll probably post my next um i'll probably post a new video tomorrow sometime tomorrow so that it can be up for tuesday or before then so i'm excited to do that i never did um a youtube youtube hop before um not sure all the ins and outs of it but i'm sure i'll learn so it should be fun um tune in for that and it starts again with um it starts tomorrow and it starts with lee moore and it's spelled L-I-M-O-R-1278 is her YouTube name. And thanks for stopping by. Um, have a good night. Have a good day, whatever time it is for you, wherever you are. And we will see you soon.